I want to show you how to record a general journal transaction. The general journal transactions are not sales transactions, they are not purchase transactions, they are not payroll transactions. Let us take an example. Here's a transaction. Adrian is the owner. On 1st of July, invested 500,000 cash in the business. So to record this transaction, which is a general journal transaction, I go to accounts. I click on the tab accounts and then click on record journal entry. When I click on that, it gives me the general journal number. It defaults to today's date and I will or write that date with 1st of July 2014. This is on the company that I have created called Intra Abhisekra, which has the financial year starting from 1st of July 2014 ends on 30th of June 2015. Because the transaction took place on 1st of July, I changed the date as to, third of, to 1st of July. On the memo, I will write here capital contribution by Adrian, the owner. This is the narration. And then I come here I click, I can tap from here, then it will go to the next, which is the account. Then when I click on this drop down arrow, I get the chart of accounts. Then I navigate down on the chart of account to find the account names. It tells us here that the amount is 500,000. Any business would keep 500,000 in the bank, not in a cash deal. Therefore, we choose the check account, the first account here, because the entry would be debit cash, increase cash, and credit the shareholders capital. So I debit the check account for the cash and I write here 500,000. Then I tab again, I press the tab on the keyboard, then it will take me to various tabs and then comes to the accounts. And then I choose from the drop down arrow, I choose code 3 accounts because that's where the equity is. So I go down and choose code 3 accounts. Here it is, owners or shareholders capital. I choose that and then it's a credit. I tab it. When I tab it, I don't even have to type that amount. MYOB assumes that there's only one 
final entry and then it records the credit and the debit and the credit matches then I press the record button and it has saved now it is trying to show me the general journal 2 an entry that I can do but I don't want to not I don't want to do another entry therefore I click on cancel how do I know whether I have entered it correctly I can go here to the transaction journal and have a look at that I will type here at the moment it has defaulted to the current date I'll type here the first day of the year 2014 and I'll enter when I enter I can see my journal entry gender journal 1 debit check account 500,000 and credit shareholders capital 500,000 so that is how you enter a general journal entry. Music